How's it going everyone? Welcome back to another video. Hopefully you guys are having a fantastic day now that it is finally warm outside. It's amazing. It's gorgeous. But I will say that I feel like it went straight from winter to summer. Like it was 30s, 40s, and then the next day it was like 80 degrees and it's been 80 degrees ever since. We miss those like mid 60s and 70s days. Those, those are the best days. But hey, I'll take heat over cold any day. Here we go. Today, we are working on the Miatas. We're working on that one as well. The main focus of the day is going to be finishing off the interior of the Rally Miata race car. We got our door cards, we got some other things, our, our gauges, and uh, this thing will be 99% done. The only thing we have to do to this interior after we're done with today, get a new steering wheel. And then and then that's it, it's, it's all done. Now this is a car you guys have seen for a while. It's been sitting in slash outside of my shop for like the past year and a half now. A lot of you guys are curious as to why it's been sitting outside my shop for so long. The short explanation is that it's my friend's car and he was working for me and in exchange for working for me, I was letting him store his car at my shop. He wasn't driving it because it's had some weird idling issues every once in a while and he didn't like driving it with the idling issues. He was gonna get it fixed, but he never did and now he's selling it. So I told him I had to help him clean it up a bit. I already gave this side a good buff and like it looks a hundred times better than it, it did. I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but this is the before, cloudy, and this is the after, nice and shiny. So we're starting this video off by finishing detailing this car and then taking some pictures of it and posting it on Craigslist to get rid of it. Drives nicely. I don't know what the problem my friend has because like every time I drive it, it drives just fine. I don't know why he just doesn't drive it. <laughs> Looks okay from right there. Uh, I think that's gonna be it for the crap Miata. Let's work on the important thing. I wanna give a huge thanks to LRB Speed for sending out these door cards. They make the best door cards, under trays, interior, exterior stuff for your, your Japanese cars. Before we throw these on the car, I'm gonna go ahead and spray a layer of clear coat on them so they're a little bit easier to clean, and then we can install them. Look at that, so fancy. While those dry, we're gonna go ahead and work on replacing these gauges with some different aftermarket ones, and then putting some stuff back in here and replacing the gauges for this thing too. You'll see. See how like worn and disgusting the heater controls look? Huge thanks again to Adam from RevLimiter for the awesome gauges. This is an HVAC panel to fix that. These are the new gauges that we're going for. Something just a little bit cleaner, a little bit simpler, a little bit more OEM looking. As always, if you guys want some awesome gauges for your Miata, head over to RevLimiter.net. Um, he's got so much stuff for the interior of Miatas. Like, it's crazy. Pretty sure he can even make you like completely custom gauges if you want him to. Uh, so it's really awesome. Go check out Adam's website. Thankfully, since we already did this once, it's gonna be really easy. Take that out, bring it over there. So from these to those. Gauges are in, needles are set. All right, and then this one goes back into the car. I like those gauges so much more. They're so much cleaner and more OEM looking, which I really like. Now we just have to make this thing not disgusting because it's, it's really disgusting right now. <laughs> Thank you. 
And there we go. Wow, that looks so much better. That is crazy. Holy shit. I'm gonna clean it up a little bit and then put it back into the car. Oh, that's so fantastic. These little flanges control all the heater stuff. It's kind of a pain in the butt. It goes right there. Boom. There we go. Boom. 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 Stop. You guys might not notice much of a difference, but to me, who's been living with that crappy one for like a year, this is so much better. And everything matches. It's white and red, white and red. The gauges are, boom, white and red. Looks so good. I like these gauges so much more than the last ones. That's all That's all good. I need to get new vent rings because the last ones I cut up to fit the, the gauges, which obviously are no longer there. But let's, let's throw these door cards on and then be done. These things are so nice and glossy now. Oh, it's gonna look so good. Oh, ugh. yes, yes, I like it a lot. Aluminum in black, oh, it's so perfect. All right, I'm just gonna do the other side and then we're done. So, so good. Ah, oh, yes. Yes, yes, it looks so good. It looks, it looks so good. Oh, it's so good, the, the two aluminums. I'm so happy, dude. This is the first time I've been satisfied with the Real Miata interior. Race car, it looks so beautiful. The flocked dash. I'm so happy with this, guys. If we could just do like a little bit of a before and after right here. Until you look at this, you just <clears throat> Sorry, Whew. almost threw up there. A couple things we had to do in here before our track day this weekend. Number one, change the oil, which is what I'm doing now. Make a new intake, which is what I'm doing tomorrow. Bleed the brakes a little bit more and change the O2 sensor. Right now, I'm just gonna change the oil real quick. Let's look at the race car. Race car. 17, maybe? Oh no, definitely 19 or 21. Car leaks a little bit of oil, all right? Don't judge. Nice. Did you just impact a drain plug on, Pasha? No. Ah. <laughs> uh. Wait, not to... No, you're definitely not supposed to do that. Uh, did you take the red thingy? The what? The funnel? The uh, funnel. Yes, I did. Sure. Noise. It's all about that good shit, though. Ignore that. Oh, you're cool. Oh no, my, I blew my engine, there we go. All right, new oil is in, that's all good. I'm not gonna put the intercooler back on because uh, it'll be easier to make the intake stuff tomorrow. We got the intercooler on there. So I think that's gonna be it for today, guys. Daily looks. Mm. <laughs> Background daily. <laughs> oh, damn, look at that. Today was a very successful day. Uh, just, cause look at that. Ugh, that's so good. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make so I'm gonna make a little, full, little floor pan uh, with grip tape on it. And then I'm gonna make a little cover for the center right there out of the same aluminum, which will match, add some more, more aluminum contrast. That, it just looks so good. I love it so much. I'm really happy with the way that turned out. This interior is finally, like I'm finally happy with this interior. Actually, wait, wait, we got one more finishing touch for the interior of the Rail Miata. We don't have these on the store anymore, um, but we are gonna get a new shipment pretty soon and it's gonna have the bus on it. Ah! Oh yeah. Oh, no! Oh, it smells so good. It smells like I'm in a forest in Montana. Oh yeah, that's nice. The interior is now complete. 99%. Just gotta Got change that steering wheel. <laughs> awesome thing about this is that this interior, it's, it's gonna stay like this forever, pretty much. We're gonna do the WRX swap, keep this interior. No more interior videos, yay. 
celebrate. Um, it's done and it looks so good. Tomorrow we are making a new custom cold air intake or slightly less warm air intake. Oh, I saw you like plotting over there. I knew you were gonna do something. You little... Uh, make sure definitely not, don't go check out Pasha's channel. No, don't do it. Yeah, don't do it. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please give it a like. If you didn't enjoy it, please give it. I can smell the, the air freshener. Give it a dislike if you didn't, didn't like it and explain why you didn't like it. Yep, so I can improve. What I was gonna say is I can smell the, the rattling me out of air freshener all the way from over here. It smells good though. It does smell good. I love the smell of pine. If you're new to the channel, please consider subscribing. I really appreciate it. I'm very excited to start ripping this thing. I'll see you guys tomorrow, and then it's race day. Pasha's coming with us, by the way. He's coming to the, the Rallycross event. That's gonna be fun. Venture on the bus. I'm excited to use the bus. It's, oh, it's just, it's gonna be so good. It's gonna be such a good summer. I'm excited. It's warm out, summer's here. Race car life. Oh. That was the old one. Oh. You can have it if you want. It's an old one. It doesn't smell anymore. <laughs> All right, bye guys.